We have Mr. Chuckle and Mr. Chuckle. Bettina D'Angelo is his new PAs. Wait here. What exactly is a PA? Personal assistant. We assist in important personal matters. Well, I'm a personal assistant. What am I then? You're a getting personal assistant. First step on the ladder. Oh, brilliant. The Chuckle Brothers. They say they're your new PAs. Oh, yes. But I thought I was. Oh, yes, I've been meaning to tell you. You're fired. But, Miss DeAngelis, may I say what a pleasure it is to meet you. I'm your number one fan, even though you do look different in real life. <laughs> and you are? We're Paul and Barry Chuckles. Your new PAs. Well, I am. He's your getting personal assistant. And we're here to relaunch your waning career. Are we? My waning career? I know. You haven't been doing so well, have you? Ever since your last single flops so badly. It was badly promoted. Exactly. And that's why we're here. I've written you a brand new song, and it's a guaranteed cert number one. And let's face it, it's a long time since you've had one of those. <laughs> Fortunately, I've got a hard copy as well. Are you still here? We've only just arrived. She's talking to me. And you. Bless you. Best of luck, you two. You'll need it. Look! Hey, can you hear him? <laughs> We've got our finger on the pulse. We know really where it's happening, man. Bling, bling. I can hear a phone ringing somewhere. No, that's me, bling, blinging. Oh. Look, I'm what's happening. I'm what's now. Yes, well, I know that, and you know that. But do the general public know that? <laughs> that's why I'm here to help. Look, I don't want help with my career from you. All I want you to do is clean and maintain the house. Capiche? Yes, we've eaten already, thank you. <laughs> as far as your finger on the pulse goes, the best place for yours is on a can of furniture polish. So, go and polish the lounge. <laughs> Barry, go and polish the lounge. <laughs> now, Bettina, or can I call you Betty? I think we should have a look at your image as well, you know. Have you thought of having a complete makeover? I mean, that hair's got to go for a start. I thought I told you to polish the lounge. Oh, don't worry. Barry's got that in hand. I'm more of the music mogul type, if you know what I mean. Then I've just the job for a man of your talent. Oh, yes. Take these and go and collect my toenail clippings. Now, now, keep your hair on. And we really must do something about those funny eyebrows. Look, you idiot. I have an important award ceremony to go to tonight, and I haven't got that long to get ready. I want to be on the front page of every paper in the country. No, wait. In the world. So just leave me alone. dare you. They're not bird droppings. I'll have you know that I'm currently rewriting the soon-to-be award-winning song which Miss Los Angeles accidentally tore in two. I don't think it was an accident, Paul. Didn't she ask you to do something? all over this sheet music. They're not bird droppings. That was me. I've done my song again for you. You know, the one you had the little accident with.
do something useful. Write out a list of party food in case people come back here after the ceremony. I told you to get those clippings picked up. Get a move on. Vacuums broken. Frankly, I put it down to shoddy maintenance on behalf of your former PA. I don't care. Party food? Cheesy sticks and Bobbrill crisps are always a popular choice. Idiot. Look at me. I have to be at the ceremony in less than an hour. If I'm not ready on time, I'll have your guts for garters. Run me a bath, you idiot! Hello, Bettina DeAngelis residence. Her getting personal PA Barry Chuckle speaking. Can I be of assistance? Lavender bubble bath. Man and red. That sounds fancy. Pineapple chunks, sausages, chips. Oh, and those chocolate rice crispy cakes. And lucky bags filled with. I was thinking more a sophisticated Eastern fusion buffet as opposed to children's party food. OK. How about marshmallows on sticks with hundreds of thousands? Oh, I forgot to give you this. Bettina de Angelis. No, I'm telling you this is Bettina de Angelis is getting personal assistant. How can I help you? Ooh. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Ooh. We have a slight problem. The plug's stuck. Oh dear. She can still take a bath though, can't she? What are you doing? Barry, under no circumstances must Bettina Los Angeles take a bath or we'll both get the sack. She'll lose her reputation and I'll lose my chance of being a music magnet. I've got 30 minutes to look a million dollars instead of looking like a chimney sweep. Now open that bathroom door, quick. Uh, Paul, Miss DeAngelis has arrived for her bath. There's a problem with the waterworks. I'm afraid it'll be a bit longer. Is my bath ready? It certainly is. <laughs> Oh, the door's jammed. It's definitely jammed. What it is, you see, the ball cock and the override valve got mixed together and it's caused a gigantic meltdown because the locking mechanism won't open the door. So I'm afraid it's, um, it's jammed. I totally agree with Barry. You see, the door's completely off kilter, which has caused an override and a meltdown. I think it'll take hours to put it right, if not days. Mm. Move. Tomato. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Can I help you? No, can I help you? You phoned me. No, I didn't. You rang me. You rang me? I didn't. You did. I didn't. You did. I didn't. You did. I did. You didn't. <laughs> I caught you there. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oi. Excuse me, I'm on the phone. Yes, I know. To me, you idiot. Oh, here, listen. I've had a brainwave. Oh, no. Barry, go fetch the face paint. The face paint? Best not move till the paint's dry. 
OK. Not you. Which gives you the perfect opportunity to listen to my new song. <laughs> Ready? Ready? One, two, three, four, five. When I see your face, my heart shouts out. You got a face like a deep bright trout. And when I look deep into your eyes, all I can see are crusty mince pies. And then when I kiss your lips, they remind me of oven fried chips. That's not oven right. Fried you know. <laughs> Infamous egg stalker. Turning up tonight guarantees I'll be egged and humiliated. <laughs> I'm never going to make it under the cover of the tabloid. <laughs> Don't worry. Me and Barry will be your bodyguards. Yes, we're always looking after Paul's body. It's no good. How dare you? Angela's former butler. Yes, but I wasn't her butler. I was her PA. And I thought she employed me for my songwriting skills. Thank you both for all your help and for keeping my reputation intact. Well, don't forget, you promised to listen to my song. Mm -hmm. Must dash and greet my adoring fans. Mwah, mwah. <laughs> Well, it looks like she's going to make the front cover of all the papers like she wanted, eh? Maybe not exactly as she wanted. Look at these bird droppings on this sheet music. How dare you? They're not bird drop drop bird bird droppings. Yes, they're not them either. Better DeAngelis former PA. You were a butler. <laughs> <laughs> 